at Churchill Downs, they give us about 15 minutes for the Belmont or Derby horses to train without anybody else being out on the racetrack. So I was thinking the other day, I get on my pony, I go out there every day, and I sit and I watch those others, the competition go by, and I get that knot in my stomach. I thought, why do I torture myself that way? Why don't I just stay in the tack room, have a cup of coffee, and say, hell, they're not that good. <laughs> but they are. And Dale, how was it when you got on your pony this morning? He did. He wanted me to get off real quick. <laughs> but Andy, that's not very nice of you. You started it. <laughs> I hope you need something off a top shelf one day. The two folks a lot better in the Belmont than it is in Kentucky Derby. And, and the horse is doing super. But I do want to point out there, right? Bob Baffert is only 25% when going for triple crowns. Well, I'm trying to get caught up with Woody. Every time I saw Woody Stevens, he said, Lucas will never win five. So if I can just last a couple more years, I think I can get it done. I know I, I'm not, I don't feel. Not this year. No, no. I don't feel real comfortable this year. But. You're talking about uh, Sunday morning? Yeah. Yeah. So I'd say uh, Wayne will get up about 3.30 and go to the barn. I'll get up about 4.30 go to the barn. Bob will get up about 7.30 and Dale about 11.30. Dale. <laughs> 1.30 if I win. Yeah. I think if you're, if it's one of us four, we're already thinking next year's derby. That's one thing that you do. When you, when those two-year-olds go around the shed row and you're looking them over, it, it's almost impossible not to dream a little bit and think maybe, maybe that's the one, maybe this is the one. Unless you're Bob Baffert and you just wake up and, you know, you know, in March and say, hell, this is the one. <laughs> uh, you know what? I was, I got, a, I left Louisville today and I'm walking by, they have the uh, Kentucky Derby Churchill Down store, and Lon Jeans has a, wa a clock going already, timing 330 days. Yeah. You see that? I saw that, and I, I go, and I took a picture of it, and I sent it, to, um, I sent it to my wife. She goes, oh, here we go. You know, <laughs> like, we're, we're always looking forward, and so, um, but there's nothing like the classics. I mean, the classics is, why we, you know, we, we sacrifice, you know, we're trainers, you have to work seven days a week to stay at this level, but, uh, but the, the, the classics is what really is so exciting for all of us. It's stressful, you know, I, I'm, I might look like I'm having fun, but it's very stressful, believe me, it's gonna be, uh, but at the same time, you know, we're, we're so fortunate to be here and it's a privilege to be able to train these horses and, um, I'm just glad Elliot sent me this horse, so thank you, Elliot, again. <laughs>